Hey folks, welcome to yet another powerful video on starting your own restaurant. My name is Gopal Kamath. I am a restauranter and the founder of Get Your Restaurant. And welcome to my channel. Welcome to my video. Today I am going to discuss the top five most important things which you need to have in order to succeed in this business. And by the way, if you are really interested to start and run your own successful food business, any kind of food business, it might be, it might be a restaurant, it might be a cloud kitchen, it might be a small lounge bar, it might be a catering or, or catering operations, it might be uh, any kind of uh, a home kitchen, or for that matter, it might be as simple as a Chinese stall. If you are really interested in starting, or if you have already started, and if you are really interested in optimizing, please uh, subscribe to this channel because. Here you will get to learn things which actually I am doing as a restauranter in my business. I own two restaurants as well as a resort and I am a founder of this beautiful, beautiful community called Get Your Restaurant on this channel which is I believe uh, growing day by day worldwide. So coming back to my most important topic of the day which is what are the five most important things you need to have in order to succeed in the food business so let's let me remove my uh, awesome uh, marker and let's let's get going so the first one is mindset mindset it all starts with what is in between these two years if you believe in yourself and if you feel that you can succeed in this business, you will succeed in this business. If you start doubting yourself and if you say, oh, chalega ki nahi chalega, kitna saal lagega, profit kitna hoga, when will the profit come, what will be the margin and if you start analyzing and if you come into that analysis paralysis mode where you start, you know, thinking more about it rather than doing it, then you are not going to succeed in this business. Mindset is one of the most important aspect of succeeding in any kind of business, but most importantly in the restaurant business. You have to have complete conviction in your mind that you are going to succeed in this. Whether this month, next month, this year, next year, you are going to succeed in it. So that complete strong mindset, once you have, you become unstoppable and nobody can take success away from you. Success will come to you one day or the other so might you have to be very strong with your mindset if you are if you are weak with your mindset or if you are really dicey that okay job karunga you know i'll have a fixed income if i if i do a business uh, it might work or not work if if you are in you know if you have two legs in two boats please don't come in this business this is, this is not for you this is not for weak hearted this is not for people who keep on analyzing and who want fast results you know just like a lottery ticket nikal diya and ek crore lag gaya and all which happens kind of like in dreams, but <laughs> so you have to have a strong focused mindset that I am all in, in this business and I am going to crush it. I'm going to make sure that this is, this is going to be successful by hook or by crook. If you have this strong mindset only after that, please uh, come in this business. Otherwise don't even think about this business. Second is planning. Planning is very, very, very important. You have to have a proper planning of your food business, it, starting from the location, starting. Achha, by the way, I am uh, uh, giving away free resources for you to study if you are going to start your food business. So go on the, uh, just follow this website www.gopalkamat.in and uh, put your name and email ID and I am going to give you a restaurant building roadmap. I'm going to give you a way of doubling your sales as far as your food business is concerned. Restaurant building roadmap is a step-by-step -step way of starting your own food business along with a lot of free uh, training material. So just go on uh, www.gopalkamat.in, put in your name and email ID and we will shoot you a mail with all the goodies. <coughs> okay, that's, that's as far as uh, the, the commercial message goes. So let's come back to the second point which is planning. So you have to have a step-by-step -step planning and you need to follow a step-by-step -step roadmap in order to succeed in this business. You cannot do haphazardly, you know, 
that cannot be the way you have to have a step by step plan of following in order to succeed in this food business only after that <coughs> excuse me only after that you will succeed in this food business third is hard work very 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 important you have to see anyways we all are doing hard work don't you agree type agree in the comment section if you agree to this we are all doing hard work from morning 8 o'clock 9 o'clock to night 8 o'clock 9 o'clock if you're doing a job or if you're doing any kind of other business or work you have to have hard work nobody is going to nobody is going to give you free lunch there is no free lunch nobody is going to give you oh, chabai, ye le, ek lakh rupiah le le. Yeah, I, I, every month I will give you one lakh, you just enjoy. So hard work is a part of life, but a lot of times I have seen people want easy money. Kind of like, uh, you know, in a stock broking or wo jo trading, mein chalta hai, ya fir, you know, they want to get rich very fast. Nowadays I have seen that uh, people want to get rich very, very fast. This business is not for you if you want to get rich fast. This is not a get rich quick scheme. It is a, you are creating a strong food business brand of yourself, which is going to sustain for years together. My grandfather had started a restaurant and now we are expanding it and we are expanding it like crazy. So this is the longevity of this business. This is not like six months mein ek, uh, hotel nikala, ek saal mein tum karodpati ban ge. This is not like that. So you have to have a hard working mindset for a longer period of time and you have to fall in love with this business. You have to you have to get attached with this business with your customers with your staff and you know you have to create kind of like a very very strong family bond where you can cook good food and serve it to your customers get money and earn earn money as well as earn blessings in return that is the third one fourth is patience this is also a very very important important uh, aspect of succeeding in this food business you need to have where, uh, you need to have a good amount of patience because as I told you, this is not a get rich quick scheme. This is not a lottery ticket. So, you know, sometimes when I get a lot of students who are following me uh, uh, in my coaching program as well as on this channel, you know, kitne jaldi profit milega? how fast can I make money? How fast can I, uh, uh, how fast can I uh, really uh, be profitable in this? So, I always tell them usually the uh, usually the break even period is in the range of 6 to 8 months maybe it might take 1 year depending on how much effort you are putting in your restaurant how much you are promoting your restaurant what all tactics you are using in your restaurant or a food business but you need to have that patience and you need to have proper planning of your financial resources also so what happens is a lot of times people don't uh, they don't involve a good amount of working capital for their food business and uh, then uh, what happens is if the sales are not good, their finances run dry, their cash flow runs dry and then they have to close down. So proper planning is also there where you have to have a good amount set aside for at least four to five to six months so that you can take care of the running costs till the time your restaurant starts making profit. And secondly, you have to have patience. This is a long term game. This is not a short term game. Cricket is not going you know, 20 over, mein, 20 over khela, next time 20 over khela. This is a long term game. You, uh, The horizon of this restaurant and the scalability of this restaurant, once once you have one restaurant which starts making profit, you can split, you can take the same model and you can split it into 3, 4, 5, 6, 10 restaurants. How much ever your appetite is, that will only come when you have patience. <coughs> Sorry. So, patience is the fourth one and the fifth and my favorite is pre perseverance or however you pronounce it. So I checked this out in uh, uh, on the in the dictionary. Perseverance means doing hard work, working towards your food business every day, irrespective of whatever the challenges come, irrespective of whatever the obstacles come. Every day, every day, every day, every week, every month, every year, till the time you are profitable and even after that, every day you have to start, you have to focus on your food business and you have to keep working on your food business because one day or the other day you are going to succeed. But till the time 
you are going to succeed in in fact once you succeed and once you start making profits you can take one or two steps back it doesn't mean that you can just leave it i chhod diya profit ho gaya to chhod do agar nahi nahi you have to focus on it but you have to focus on the key metrics initially you have to do a little bit of hard work in all the departments so perseverance i think i got this pronunciation right perseverance is very very important mindset is number 1 second is proper planning proper planning of the mindset is having a very 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 strong mindset that i am going to do my i am going to succeed in my this business i am not going to leave this business till it becomes profitable and i am going to scale in this business i am going to expand in this business. very strong mindset proper planning proper planning of resources proper planning of finances now a lot of times people don't have any money and they want to come into this business i always tell them you take care of your home expenses first set aside a little bit of money and then you can go for a funding bank loan mudra loan or whatever and you can uh, start your restaurant but ekdam you know if you don't have any money just don't jump into this business you have to do proper planning for finance planning proper uh, restaurant planning staff planning uh, menu planning branding everything comes into the planning and then hard work is there hard work is very very important if you are not ready to do the hard work if you want easy money please don't come in this business you are going to lose money because your mindset is totally different this this business requires hard work and you want lazy money that is not possible yeah so third thing fourth is patience you have to give time you know it this your restaurant is like a baby like how a baby takes time from from 6 months 1 year 1 and a half year 2 year 3 year then slow after 1 year it starts walking so it takes time to grow good things take time to grow so please uh, have this in mind and fifth is perseverance every day irrespective of whatever obstacles come you, uh, you have to show up every day and you have to succeed because this business can change your life this business can create so much wealth for you and so much good wishes for you also this is a, a, a this is a punya ka kaam as they say by feeding people by by quenching their thirst but at the same time you get money you make good friends you create a brand for yourself and you have a chance of taking the same model expanding it and creating a chain of restaurant for yourself so i hope uh, you like the video once again if you have not got the free training as well as the free gifts which i am uh, giving you regarding starting your own food business go to www.gopalkamath.in and sign up and uh, sign up in the sense just put in your name email id and we will email you all the free goodies we have the restaurant building road map i forgot all the things which i have uh, we have we have the winning formula to double your sales we have the restaurant journey uh, road map and we have a complete uh, training also so make sure you go to www.gopalkamath.in i hope you enjoyed the video please comment on this share it with your friends as well as if you have any questions regarding the food business because i create videos dep depending on your questions so put the questions in the comment section i read each and every comment and uh, once i find it great i am going to create a video on that also so keep watching this video keep watching this channel there are loads and loads of good uh, valuable videos regarding starting your own food business and succeeding in the food business and i will talk to you in the next video bye bye love from me bye bye